Hey, what's going on guys? You're watching another episode of D Jones Outdoors. I am your show host, DJ Jones. Today is Thursday, March 2nd. I am back in northern Minnesota here again. I'm getting ready to do some ice fishing before I head off tomorrow with the lady to go do what I love to do, which is whitetails. Yes, I will be going back to the Iowa Deer Classic, so probably by the time you guys watch this, I'll have already went to the Classic and hopefully met up with a bunch of my old friends and hopefully made some new friends and uh, get that thrown up on the YouTube channel for you folks. But um, yeah, we're getting ready to do some ice fishing. I am not sure if I'm gonna keep any fish. I got my fray bill, got the Garmin Live Scope ready to go. I got my 13 fishing rod and reels. Well, like not like 13 fishing rod and reels. I mean, I do have that many, but I'm just saying like the 13 fishing, you know, like rod and reel combinations for ice fishing. The thermal ice ones, but, uh, but some of y'all already knew that. And if you didn't know, now you know. But uh, yeah, I'm on the road, almost to the lake. Hopefully we can get some great fish today. Four eyes, two eyes, me, but I'm not so sure. Let's get this money, B. Well, I think I got everything. I think I locked the truck. It's 84 years. All right. Looks like we're going to be at the first spot to drill. Whew. That was almost an accident. All right, let's get his money. Hey guys, I'm getting things started with my 13 thermal ice fishing rod and reel set up. I also have my Northland Tackle Forge Minnow spoon here. I'm trying to see if I can show you guys what that looks like, but get some waxies tied on here. I'm gonna go bombs away real quick. All right, folks, here's the first drop of the day. Oh, got one coming up off the bottom already through the weeds. Oh, there we go. Did not take long, folks. Did not take long. Oh, it's a good perch. Yeah, guys, here we go. Nice little perch. Okay, there we go. Oh, nope, dropped me again. I mean, they are down there, folks. Oh, there we go. This one feels like it's a bigger one. Oh, yeah, this one's a bigger one. <laughs> Look at this one. I mean, just a nice little jumbo perch. Another tiny one. Oh, I wish this perch would probably get a little bigger. Yeah, here he come. Here he come. And they will. They will hit the bare four spoon. Oh, okay, there we go. This one could be a good one, a better one. Not too big though. Not a keeper. Mm, another good size perch. Yeah, folks, I mean, <laughs> looks like we're gonna have us uh, some perch tonight. I can keep it up at this rate. Get on back down there with that four spoon real quick. They are in there, folks. On the ground. Oh, got another one. Oh, no, well, I guess that works too. 
Got a little perch. Not a keeper, so back you go. Hole number two. Let's see what we got down there. All right, folks, here we go. First drop at the new hole. Sitting at about 14 feet. There I am there. Oh, we got him coming. Oh, there we go. One for another perch. And a perch it is. So not a keeper, so he's going back. Good luck, buddy. I hope you find your dad. Well, hopefully we can get some more keepers out of here. another one. Oh, that one got off in the hole. A little fella, a little fish stick. A little fish stick right there, folks. A little fish stick right there. Look at him. Uh, either move again to hopefully find some bigger, some bigger perch, or I'll just have to stick to these holes and try to cull up and keep putting them back till we get some bigger keepers oh there we go this live scope is amazing folks watch those fish literally come up off of the bottom out of that grass and just hit your bait it's a game changer I've had the lady out here catching fish with the pan optics with me and it's been fun, it's been fun, it's been fun. I mean, they come right off of that bottom too, folks, and they just hammer it. Oh, got away with that time. Oh, got away with it that time. Got bit. Oh, God, money. A little fella though. Man, these perks are chewing. Well, I think it's safe to say I'm on a school. I'm gonna go in with he's a little feller. He's a little feller. Well folks, that's gonna be a wrap for me today out here on beautiful God's creation on the ice. Doing a couple holes, caught a couple fish. Couldn't be uh any more more couldn't be any more fun than that. Um, everything I caught today was on uh, that Northland Tackle Ford Spoon. I uh, had one of the orange ones and one of the pink spoons on today and caught literally everything on that with a wax worm. And uh, couldn't be more pumped. I still feel like, you know, I have a lot of room to grow as an angler. This being only year two of me taking ice fishing seriously. Uh, I'm feeling pretty good. I feel like this is a great start, but can't wait to pick a new lake tomorrow and uh, hopefully catch some bigger and better fish. That's what I love about Minnesota. You know, thousands of lakes to go check out and uh i like that thanks for watching another episode of dino's outdoors stay blessed